Hey, you can cheer on Cesar Salazar, the former Tucsonan, and all the players throughout the weekend at the Kino Sports Complex. When it comes to weather, of course, luck just hasn't been on Coach John Perlman and FC Tucson's side this season. It was a must-win situation for FC Tucson against the Central Valley Juego FC as mathematically they were still alive for a postseason run, but that also means cashing in on the home field advantage. However, with lightning strikes and rain, the game got postponed until after 9 p.m. and there were very few fans in the 2-0 loss. As we show you some of the highlights on the field of FC Tucson, who didn't end its game until nearly midnight this morning, we can also tell you this, sadly, Southern Arizona Heritage Night was spoiled by the rain. That was the theme for the FC Tucson game. There was supposed to be a walk right beforehand with the diehard FC Tucson supporters, the Cactus Pricks, opening with a big parade. Didn't happen, though, and sadly, it appears FC Tucson's chances for a late playoff push are now over with. What should have been a home field advantage on many occasions just did not pan out for FC Tucson because of multiple games with multiple rain delays, meaning less fans in the stands. It's tough. You know, you're starting games late here. We've had basically five neutral site games here. Um, our crowd wants to be here. We want to have them here. The weather doesn't cooperate. And, and you need that when you're home, that kind of lift, that kind of push would have been so helpful tonight. Um, but the truth was, technically, we weren't good enough moments. We had a couple chances. I thought the first half was pretty even with us, you know, starting to really show some strength in the in the second part of that half. And but again, we've got some tired legs and some guys that are on limited minutes, and uh, some guys who are just rusty from not being able to play. And